somewhat very interesting case because the sinus is completely invertised and uh, even the mandible is quite resolved. So just come closer, I will show you the OPG, it will become more clear. So as you see on this OPG x-ray, uh, these two teeth have fractured, so we are going to remove canine premolar, place a pterygoid implant here. Now in such situations, it will be also recommended to add a zygomatic implant. So you can see the zygomatic bone over here. So the plan here is that zygomatic implant uh, one small implant if required over here and two implants over here that's the plan pterygoid i'm not sure in such a weak situation how it will happen but definitely we can attempt it so one pterygoid zygoma nasalis implants and one short implant is the plan over here over here mandible uh, you may feel that there is lot of height but when you see in the patient's mouth it is quite resolved which means it's a very thin ultra pencil thin mandible so mandible depending on the situation how the maxilla goes we will handle it either with a buccal bypass or a lingual cortical engagement if there is undercut so let's go on to the case and i will show you live i'm starting with the pterygoid implant so as usual i will palpate the hamula process Okay, this is the tuberosity area. I palpated the hamula process and I'll go towards the hamula process. Like this. Gentle melting. Okay. This is my probable, I am getting a good resistance here. So this is my probable direction for the implant. Okay, Gabriel, ah, relax. Now I will use my first drill which is my pilot drill. The speed will be around 3000 RPM. Stay at this. Very very soft quality bone as expected. So next I will be using my 2.0 drill and most likely that will be my last drill for a 4.0 implant. Okay. 